you want to connect your IoT device to your own dashboard where you can see real-time values from your sensors. Hi there and welcome to another tutorial where we are going to build an IoT dashboard with authentications, a homepage where it shows you the values of the sensors in real time, an impressive view of your device operating in 3D, a sections to configure the connection of your device, a profile sections and fully responsive where we are going to build it using the technologies Next.js, TypeScript, Daywheel, ChatCDN, Superbase, Thingsboard, and we will use Wokwe for simulating an IoT device. Before diving into the code, let's see how this works. First, we have our login page where you can register by entering your email and password or alternative using GitHub credentials. Then on the home page, we can see at the bottom a slider with real-time sensor values. In this case, as we have a weather stations, we displace values such as temperature, humidity, pressure, wind speed, etc. At the top, we have a section to view user information and then we have another section where we can configure the connection with things war. The architecture of this project is, in the backend, we will have Superbase to assist us with user authentications and saving configurations in the database. Then we will have Thingsport to manage devices. We will use its MQTT broker to connect with the sensors. We will also use its rule change for sensor data filtering. All of this is made possible through the Thingsport API. Finally, Next.js will assist us in creating the customized dashboard. We will communicate with server actions to the Thingsboard API to obtain sections tokens, and then we will communicate via WebSockets to Thingsboard to read data on the dashboard in real time. Then, in the end, we will deploy it on Bersal and have everything working and ready to connect the sensors. In this project, we took a weather station as an example, but it is highly configurable for any IoT solutions. This project took me many hours of dedications, and if you like the idea and want to support me, you will help me a lot by liking the video and subscribing to the channel for more content like this.